Hi, my name is Janice, founder of PinayInvestor.com. This is the first part of the video series entitled Stock Market for Beginners, Understanding the Basics by Pinay Investor. I hope you have already seen my previous video where I shared a little bit about myself and how I started in stock market. Today, I will share with you the basics of stock market. The topics that I will cover will answer the following questions. What are stocks? What is a stock market? What is PSE or Philippine Stock Exchange? And what are publicly listed companies and why do they go public? So let's start with the first question. What are stocks? Stocks, which are also known as shares or equities, represent ownership in a company or a corporation. Yung ownership na yan, ang ibig sabihin yan, you own a small portion of that company. For example, si PLDT ay isang malaking company or corporation. If you buy stocks or shares from PLDT through the stock market, you become a stockholder or shareholder. In other words, you become a part owner of that company. So again, part owner ka ng company. Hindi ibig sabihin, pagmamayari mo na yung company. Kasi, part owner ka lang. And as a part owner, you participate in the company's earnings or losses. Ibig sabihin, kung si company nag-earn or si company nag-declare ng growth or profits, kasama ka doon. Ibig sabihin, pwede kang kumita ng dividends, pwede ka rin mag-earn through their earnings. Pero, if the company suffers a loss or performs below market expectations, affected ka din dun because you are a part owner. The number of stocks you acquire will determine how big or small your ownership is. And as you acquire more stocks, your ownership stake in the company becomes greater. Let's take an example of a whole pizza pie. Yung buong pizza pie na yon nagre-represent ng isang malaking company or corporation, halimbawa PLDT. So kapag bumili ka ng stocks or shares ng PLDT, you own a small slice from that whole pizza pie. Ibig sabihin, you're a part owner or you're a stockholder of PLDT. Next question, what is a stock market? The stock market is a place where stocks are bought and sold. It is a place where people can invest in publicly listed companies through the Philippine Stock Exchange Incorporated or the PSE. So kung sa wet market, doon natin nabibili yung mga goods. Sa stock market, doon natin mabibili at mabibenta yung stocks or shares ng companies na publicly listed sa PSE or sa Philippine Stock Exchange. So dito nangyayari yung buying and selling of stocks. Now, what is PSE or Philippine Stock Exchange? The Philippine Stock Exchange is the only stock exchange in the Philippines. It currently maintains two trading floors, one at the PSE Center in Ortigas, and the other one, which is the principal office, is at the Ayala Tower 1 in Makati. So, ano ang role ng PSE sa stock market? The PSE brings buyers and sellers together and it facilitates the sales and purchase of stocks. Para siyang guardian ng stock market. It makes sure that the transactions are done in an efficient, orderly, fair, and transparent manner. It also enforces rules and regulations na dapat sundin ng mga publicly listed companies at lahat ng trading participants including us as investors. And the fourth question is, what are publicly listed companies and why do they go public? Okay, a company becomes publicly listed when its shares are traded in the PSE. Kung nabibili at naibibenta na ang isang company sa PSE or sa Philippine Stock Exchange, ibig sabihin, publicly listed company yan. And to become a publicly listed company, a company must meet the stringent listing and reportorial requirements of the PSE to safeguard the investor's interests and ensure transparency. 
Ibig sabihin, hindi lahat ng companies pwedeng maisali sa publicly listed companies sa PSE kasi meron mga certain requirements na kailangan nilang i-meet before they become a publicly listed company. Now you ask, why do companies go public? According to PSE, there are four main reasons why companies go public. The first is, it's a cost-effective way of raising capital. So kapag ang isang company ay gustong mag-expand or gustong magtayo pa ng ibang branches or franchises or kung ano pa man, of course they'll need a capital. And to raise a capital, pwede silang maging publicly listed company sa PSE and from there, pwede silang makalikom or makaraise ng capital kasi magbebenta sila ng shares sa mga investors. So kapag bumili yung mga investors ng shares from that company, syempre, makakaipon sila ng capital, which they can then use to expand their businesses. Second, to save cash reserves. Ibig sabihin, hindi nila kailangang sagarin yung cash nila, hindi nila kailangang sagarin yung funds ng companies or yung reserves nila dahil gusto nilang mag-expand. Kasi sa isang company, it's important for them to have cash reserves para kung ano man ang mangyari, meron silang nakareserva. So instead of using all their cash reserves, they go public para mas makapag-raise pa sila ng capital instead of using their remaining resources. Third, to improve credit ratings. Companies going public is a good option para hindi na nila kailangang mangutang sa banks or other financial institutions to raise capital. So kapag wala silang mga utang sa banks or other financial institutions, pwedeng mag-improve yung credit ratings nila. And fourth, they can return to the market anytime to raise funds. So kapag kinailangan pa nila ng additional funds, pwede ulit silang bumalik sa market para mag-raise ng capital. So those are the four main reasons kung bakit those companies go public. Now if you are wondering kung bakit yung mga malalaking companies like PLTT, BDO, Jollibee, BPI, and other big companies ay nasa stock market, these are the possible reasons why these companies go public. I tried my best to answer the questions the easiest and the simplest way that I possibly could, and I hope you understood it. So what is a stock market? The stock market is a place where stocks are bought and sold. It's a place where people can invest in publicly listed companies through the Philippine Stock Exchange Incorporated or the PSE. I hope you found this video helpful and if you have other questions or kung medyo naguguluhan pa kayo dun sa inexplain ko, please feel free to post your comments down below and I might be able to create another video explaining this topic na mas maiintindihan nyo pa. Thank you for watching and I hope you can also subscribe to my channel, it's Pinay Investor, and please visit my blog at pinayinvestor.com.